so uh, my uh, juniors had talked to me once i uh, ca- cleared kvpy and uh, they had decided that they will also join vedantu and they will try from home it's a uh, confusing thing for a 10th grader after uh, getting a good score in 10th we don't know where to go and if we are staying at home we are not confident enough if we will be able to crack it some are not ready to uh, move far from home so uh, you can crack all these exams from home uh, what you need is determination and hard work and good guidance from a good uh, coaching center i am gautam shankar uh, i am from kerala i scored 673 marks in neat with an all india rank of 1328 so i am from uh, malappuram district of kerala in a na- uh, region named tirur so it's uh, not a very developed city it's slowly developing area it's uh, not the place very known for coaching so uh, i'm the first uh, doctor in my family and i am i am really excited to tell them the result and uh, even they are uh, really uh, excited for the upcoming journey my mbbs journey uh, i'm get i got uh, appreciations from all of them and i think uh, i have a small impact on my uh, fellow uh, classmates and those who uh, my juniors uh, some of them had jo- uh, joined vedantu classes after uh, asking me from a very small age i had the aim of becoming a doctor so it's a really good profession we have both fame uh, it's no it's a noble profession you can serve millions of people as long as i remember i always wanted to become a doctor so i started my uh, preparation in 11th for neat uh, after 10th my parents were confused uh, they were searching for a coaching center and in kerala there's a town called pala uh well it's the coaching hub and i had taken admission in a coaching center over there and i was not ready to uh, move far away from my home then my school here uh, in my region also provides an inter- entrance embedded coaching and then uh, i decided that i'll try one year from home with 11th and 12th and that time it was uh, the time of board exams of 10th and i had seen some youtube videos of uh, vedantu uh, in youtube and they were really helpful so i uh, joined on vedantu classes and thought that i'll get the support for my uh, neat preparation started my journey in 11th and for any normal student who studied uh, cbse in 10th grade it's a really big transition from 10th to 11th and uh, i couldn't really cope up well with my 11th and uh, at first it was really hard uh, my aptitude was not very good and i couldn't grasp the concepts uh, easily especially of physics and uh, my you know orga- organic chemistry was also really weak in 11 and then uh, slowly i had to fo- uh, focus i was also solving very less amount of questions which is really uh, a huge mistake we need to practice lot many questions for uh, get, uh, improving in need by the time i rectified uh, I, i realized these mistakes and i rectified them like 3/4 of my 11th was o- over and uh, then i realized that i had to rectify these errors and i had to cover my backlog of these 11 chapters and focus on my 12th also so it was all a roller coaster for me in the beginning of 12th by the time there's a gap between 11th and 12th uh, before the 12th classes start so that time i could cover a little bit of 11th then uh, i had to leave 11th entirely and for complete the rest of 11th after completing my 12th exam and in 12th uh, i got really fantastic teachers in vedantu i didn't even need to revise 12th after my classes i could just go back and complete my 11th backlog uh, i didn't have to spend time on 12th i would solve more questions Uh, if if i restart my preparation i would solve more questions in 11th itself uh, this year i didn't i didn't solve much questions in 11th which made me to uh, rush after completing my 12th i couldn't revise my 12th entirely so i had to rush with uh, my 11th uh, question solving also for physics uh, i was focusing more on memorizing the formula rather than, uh, than the concept so in 12th i rectified this by studying the concept properly so that i knew where to apply them 
and uh, Vipul sir, my physics teacher in 12th, really helped me do that. And in organic chemistry, uh, it was a problem for me in 11th and in 12th, my t uh, teacher Govind sir, he had shared uh, no his notes of his 11th batch so that I'd, I could prepare and I had watched some YouTube like. The number of hours which you study is uh, not important. The amount of content you cover which decide your score. As uh, for a 12th grader who is giving neat along with his 12th exams, it's hard to find time. Uh, I had school, I uh, reached back from school at about uh, 5.30 and 5.30 my uh, Vedandu classes began. So I didn't have any free time and my uh, Vedandu sessions used to last till like uh, 10 p.m. And after that, I stayed up till 12.30. So in a, a weekday, I could get only two hours and 30 minutes, like only uh, two, 30, two hours, 30 minutes for my studies. But in weekdays, I used to spend much more time. I used to complete the uh, syllabus, which was covered in the week. I had bought some books, but then uh, I, I got my Vedantu material, the Tattva. And I felt that it was really helpful, especially the uh, levels of question. First, we saw the basic and then the levels keep increasing and we reach the advanced level questions. And uh, such questions helped me uh, to crack other exams also like JE, KVPV, etc. I had cracked those exams also and the credit of that goes to the modules of Vedantu. So uh, my uh, juniors had talked to me once I uh, cleared KVPY and uh, they had decided that they will also join Vedantu and they will drive from home. It's a confusing thing for a 10th grader after uh, getting a good score in 10th. We don't know where to go and if we are staying at home, we are not confident enough if we will be able to crack it. Some are not ready to uh, move far from home. So uh, you can crack all these exams from home. Uh, what you need is determination and hard work and good guidance from a good uh, coaching center.